hello everyone welcome back to my channel again so my dear friends today i am with another passing package video for 2021 scheme students the subject is uh, material science and engineering its subject code is 21 me 33 if you have a backlog in this particular subject so let me discuss some important questions important passing package for you people so that uh, it will become easy for you people to cover these all questions i have taken uh, eight eight questions from each module uh, at least you have to cover six marks uh, six questions from each module to cover uh, every module over there right so there are three passing modules in which you have to focus more than the rest of the two modules so let me discuss uh, let me start with uh, this video with this passing module that is first first module structure of materials it is a passing module and a very easier one convenient one right so first of all a super important question is differentiate between crystalline solids and non crystalline solids also mention classification of engineering materials this is the first question next one is define planar atomic density and atomic packing factor then what are the voids and write down the classification and coordination of voids right then bragg's law you have to focus on and imperfections in solids types of imperfections which is the super important question and we should have some uh, knowledge about point defects line defects already come across from the pu second were there and 2d and uh, 3d defects were there then differentiate between edge, di edge dislocation and screw dislocation so it is the most important question as far as this material science subject is concerned it was always uh, it was frequently asked in the examination video examination were there if you uh, consider 17 18 or 15 scheme were there so this time definitely this will uh, uh, this will appear in the examination over there this is the most important question that is edge dislocation and screw dislocations over there then what is atomic bonding this is another question so these are the eight questions which you have to cover in the module first which is a passing module so next one module second which is also a mass, uh, passing module over there that is physical metallurgy so in which you have to cover with the neat sketch explain fix first and second law of diffusion most important one which i call here as super important question then next one is draw iron carbon diagram or sometimes they uh, just give a short form that is fe fe3c diagram over there that is iron carbon diagram indicate the phase temperatures and locate invariant points over there it is also a super important question in the module second over there so you have to focus on these two questions and next one is that is define solid solution describe the classification of solid solution over there then gives phase rule you should have some knowledge and role of imperfections in diffusion next one is state and explain homo row three rules which are which is the most important one which i also called as super important in this particular module then important phase diagrams prob little bit problems are there if you are convenient with problems just go through if not convenient just leave that particular uh, problematic part over there just focus on theory also right then method of measuring hardness in rockwell hardness test machine so this is enough for the module second so these are again eight questions in which you have to cover at least six questions uh, you can leave the problematic part if you are not convenient just because this is a theoretical subject over there so very uh, least problems are over there then next is the passing module that is module three which is nucleation and growth over there so deduce the expression for critical radius of nucleation most important one right so next one is define homogeneous and heterogeneous nucleation it is also an important one <clears throat> next one is differentiate between annealing and normalizing uh, it is also a most important question right then explain hardening uh, explain hardening heat treatment flame hardening and draw situmatic uh, ttt diagram right triple t diagram over there this is most important one and also this one is important one so i have taken these questions so which will be which will appear in the examination part over there so this is the important one for the module third and uh, you should uh, know about another two questions in the module third which is the passing module as i earlier mentioned so uh, explain the concept of mechanisms behind strengthening in metals also explain strength, uh, strengthening by grain size reduction over the year then some definitions you should also know over the year as per syllabus this will definitely come in the examination uh, tempering or tempering and night riding cyaniding induction hardening and twinning and slave these are the little bit definitions which you have to cover in your own convenient language so try to understand these concepts 
in your language then you can <coughs> easily write, write this part in your examination in your own words right so these are the three passing modules which in which you have to focus fully uh, then rest of the two uh, rest of the two modules which are uh, remaining here so you can it is your choice you can just refer three to four questions or uh, three to, uh, or sorry two questions which are the most important one from each module you can take out over there so but i have taken here the important questions if you just cover these also so it will become easy for you people to cover this subject right then module fourth that is uh, in which you have to cover what is coating mention types of coating over there and advantages and disadvantages of surface coating is important one over here then explain mechanical and chemical methods of uh, powder production techniques over there this is a super important question what is sintering and application of powder metallurgy particle size and shape distribution how it influences the characterization of powders over there so these are the two topics uh, in which you have to write down how it influences this characterization of uh, powders over there right then what are the lubricants and binders uh, powder shaping particle packing modifications is the important one over there then module fifth comes up so which is the last module over here in the material science so in which you have to cover uh, different types of design explain each type over there Explain the procedure for measuring hardness by Brin, uh, Brinell's hardness testing equipment, most important one, and need for material selection in design. This is the theoretical module, so you have to just understand the concepts and try to write down it in your own, own words over there. Then evolution of engineering materials over there, process of obtaining materials data and write down the properties of engineering materials right it is all about the engineering materials and design so it, uh, you should know as a mechanical engineer so you should know about the designs and the properties of uh, materials over there then the selection criteria for materials uh, right then simple problems uh, as you can refer to the previous year question paper also so to find out the uh, question will be there so you have to find out the Young's modulus so data will be given about all so you have to find out the Young's modulus yield stress ultimate stress percentage elongation percentage reduction area at, re at least try this problem also just because it is a very simple one you have to uh, you just need to put down the formulas for Young's modulus yield stress then you can easily uh, what we call find out the values of these particular problems so this much is enough to pass material science subject right so i hope you will just do it so a little bit practice you need over there so that it will become easy for you people to conquer this particular material science subject which is a theory, theoretical subject and the, also syllabus is very vast so you cannot cover all that so I have taken that is why I have taken some important questions for you people so that it will become easy for you right now right so uh, I hope you will cover all these portions over there so you have only I think uh, two or three days for this particular subject so just do hard work and make sure you will share this video to all your friends who are who are having backlog in this particular subject that is material science so that they can also avail benefits from such type of passing package so thanks for watching my video